Let's go with another game. Again, so between this guy tempo or blue, white, red tempo and Underworld Dreams. This will be the third matchup, and <laughs> it has proven to be very difficult somehow for this guy Tempo. So this time, let's cut. All right, I'm playing against Oli, and maybe I should begin. Something tells me that that this matchup is killing me somehow. But Oli is an awesome player. He's just killing me with his amazing hands. Kindness. <laughs> I've learned the lesson. I I can see my hand. I made a mistake before. I think I won't do it again. So I'm going to do mulligan. And I will show you the hand so that you know what I'm talking about. Okay, okay. So I will keep my hand. Yes. And I'm really looking forward to you. So the library of Alexandria and nothing to do. All right. Otherwise. Yeah, it's risky. I think against your deck, I've learned the lesson. I think this is the, the good thing about playing these matchups where you finally get to see is it good to use library against you or against this deck or against the other deck. <clears throat> I think attempting to play the long game against Underworld Dreams is a bad decision. I think so too. You, you need to apply a certain amount of pressure. Yes. And if I expect to find lands with library of Alexandria, like in the last game, I don't think it will work. So, seven. And this doesn't look as good as I expected. I have plenty of dead cards in my hand, so I'm going to go down to Mulligan to five. Okay. And it's going to pay off because I don't think I could have done anything with Recall plus two Schwarz to Plowshares. No, 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 no. They Basically, don't do anything. At least two dead cards in the match. Mm -hmm. This doesn't look very good for my deck right now, for GSK Tempo, so let's see if I get to have any Tempo at all with 5 cards. At least we have this London Mulligan. Alright, I can do something with this. So, first of all I have to put 2 away, so I will put 1. And... Because of Tempo... Ah... How does this work? How does this work? This could prove to be very useful, but it depends on how many moxes he will have. Yeah, let's go all in, all in. So I'm going to put two cards at the bottom and I'm going to start. All right, let's go. So I will play City of Brass. Sure. Crack for white. Okay. One and two. Okay. <laughs> and now it's your turn. Let's go. Hopefully you don't find land, land, lightning, lightning. <laughs> I will draw a card. Let's drop an underground C. Mox Ruby. Mm -hmm. ah. And bolt one of the guys. Makes totally sense. That's unfortunate for me. Okay. And I think there is no damage done in playing the Mox Jet oh as well. Oh my god. And it's your turn. All right. So I draw. And I'm going to destroy your underground sea. Okay. Tempo play, two damage. Five. Hopefully, 18. I disrupted the black sources enough for now. Let's draw a card. Mm -hmm. No. Let's go with the Bayou and pass the turn. All right. Draw, attack. 16. And go. <laughs> okay. That's my game, bro. Did you expect anything else? All right, there's the bad lands. No, that's really bad. Like actually, literally bad lands. Mm. Yes. 
as long as you don't have a second land drop. Oh, Let's play that. Yes. Underground C. And the Lotus as well. Oh my god. Go. Pew. There we go. What is this? <laughs> Two damage? 14. Your turn. Drop. <laughs> All right. back. That's an amazing draw. Okay. And I think we're already ready to go for it. You're at 19 life. You only do have one land drop. So I think we have to play the time twister right now. Ooh. Taking one damage. Respawns. <laughs> okay, so you take one damage. Sure. I take another damage. Okay, I will reduce this already. And in response, I would like to cast Lightning Ball on you. Yeah, sure. So you go down to 10. Thanks. And I go <laughs> down to 11 because drawing is bad. All right. Discarding the whole. You know, I was planning on this until yeah. <laughs> you played that. So. <laughs> GG. Oh, by the way, Time Twister stays in the, in the graveyard. Oh, it was a twist on the Yeah, that's true. Thanks a lot. No problem. Not that I want you to cast it again. <laughs> and you still have Lotus and yeah. everything ready for action. Just crazy. This deck is so good. Underworld Dreams, man. Especially against Control. I feel so too. You can really sit back, relax and wait for the window of opportunity to yeah. just go all out. There we go. May all the unluck be with you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let's draw seven cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Okay. Well, got ten I, life. I got eleven life. I already um, <laughs> hit one. my land. Drop? Yes. So... I will play the Sylvan Library Oof, and that's pass good. my turn. Okay. This relaxes me, even though... <laughs> even though obviously it's not, as, it's not good for me, but it's much better than something else. Alright, so I'm taking one damage. Sure. Ten! Even! And I believe this is going to be... Mox Sapphire. Okay. Followed by Mox Ruby. All right. Followed by Mistress Factory. Followed by the Beatdowns. Going to eight. And I think it's going to be your turn. Okay. So. Save my <laughs> library. Never forget. Never forget. <laughs> One, two, three. Come on, go for it. It's just eight lives. Oops, <laughs> you would lose the game. <laughs> I think we can play quite comfortably here and just draw one card. Okay. Develop our mana base. Playing the time walk. This question. Last time, time work was devastating, but what are you going to do? Hmm. I think it's going to resolve. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I think this is this is one spot where we might want to play it safe and. Just take the extra turn. Alrighty then. That pleases me. <laughs> Seven library once again. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Okay. Let's draw a card. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Play the land and it's your turn. Aha! This is very good news because I would like to do something at the end of your turn. Alright. 
which is cyanic blast on you. Okay. What do you say to that? I think that's the one card I like to mana drain. Yes, makes sense. Makes sense. So it's my turn. And let's quickly. Yes. Put the dice down. You get three mana next turn. Yeah. Of course, you have an underworld dreams, so I have to take one damage because I drew one card. <laughs> sure. And I'm going to deploy a tundra. Yeah. And let me count. Because if I were to activate the Mistress Factory. Okay. And attack with both, what would happen? Considering taking the damage. All right. Going down to four. Which means I could make a Jolo move and lose the game, but I will say it's your turn. <laughs> All right. So, it's even library again. Yes. One, two, and three. Oh, well, that's a fun card. I will take it. Mm -hmm. All right. So, what's going on is that I will Flood the three mana in my main phase. Yes. And let's quickly count it up. Go for three mm -hmm. additional one. It's six generic, one red. Wow. Okay. Okay. And one, two, three. Lightning bolt for, I'm sorry. Fireball. Let's do it like this. Fireball for nine. Am I right? So three plus Three plus three. Yeah. <laughs> now we are to your face. Now we are in this situation. Whether this and these doesn't change a thing. <laughs> okay. What if I would answer to Cyanic Blast your face? Would you have a Flash counter. Because if I would have countered it, you yeah, could have sure. flash counter anyway. But I would, uh, I would try to uh, play a power sink. And I think that's game. <laughs> <laughs> well played, well played, well played. Very well played, very well played. Oh my god, one turn away. Jess Guy Tempo cannot recover. Amazing.